I'm Emmy Tokuda, um, and I'm a graduate student here in Christy Anset's lab. Um, my project centers around trying to understand local microenvironmental influences on melanoma drug resistance. Um, a lot of this stems from the fact that melanoma is just really difficult to treat in later stages of progression. So melanoma is a type of skin cancer, and the incidence rate is really on the rise. They're, they're finding that, for whatever reason, Metastatic melanoma is really difficult to treat. They find that patients will relapse on average within like six months, and the five-year survival rate is about 15%. So there's a lot of work going into either developing new drugs or trying to understand biologically why it might be an issue and why melanoma is so drug resistant. How did I get into this? <laughs> um, you know, I really got interested in science in high school, actually. It was one of my biology teachers. She was just, she loved biology, and I was kind of like, how can anyone really like it that much? But when we actually got into it, it was incredibly interesting. And then once I went to college, you know, you learn about all these unmet clinical needs that are out there. And so it really drove me to ask, well, is there any way that we can address any of these? I mean, there's a lot of place for improvement. And, you know, medicine, medical devices, and things like that. Um, and there were also a few incidences of illness in my family, which really motivated me further. Some people are driven by curiosity. They just want to know how the world works and why things are happening the way that they are. Um, a lot of people from my undergraduate class were interested because, you know, one guy that I met, his mom died of cancer. And so he got into, you know, bioengineering and trying to understand cancer and treatments and things like that. My cells are pretty needy, so usually they need to be fed and taken care of um, every other day, probably. But one of the cell lines that I work with, I have four different melanoma cell lines, and one of them tends to multiply really, really fast. <laughs> so I usually need to check on them quite often and make sure that they don't get too crowded in the plate. Otherwise, their behavior can actually change. I think to really figure out if you really like science and engineering is really to get into research, um, because that is often what people will end up doing with those type of degrees. And um, it's hard work, but I think it's worth it in the end, um, because if you find something that you find rewarding, I think it's worth it in the end. Thank you.